So I'm going to stop debugging uh, this program and uh, go back uh, to our example. So in summary, when we manipulate 8-bit uh, eight, eight values, an overflow flag indicates that the result is too large to fit. Um, and uh, the sum of two positives exceeds 127, as we observed in, uh, in all of these examples, or the difference of two negative uh, operands is less than uh, 128 negative. Okay, so the carry flag simply indicates that the sum, uh, the sum of two unsigned uh, operands exceeded 255. And finally, sign flag indicates that the result was negative. So what else can we do with uh, the flag register? Uh, as you see that these flags, uh, most of these um, arithmetic uh, status flags are located in uh, the lowest uh, uh, byte of the flag register. So there is an instruction uh, named LH uh, load AH uh, with flags which uh, loads the lower byte, uh, this lower byte right here, it's loading it into register AH. And so 8 bits of the flags are transferred, sign 0, uh, uh, ancillary carry, parity, and carry flag. So the instruction format is just, uh, the mnemonic is like this. So uh, the store uh, flags restores the value of the lower byte flags. So notice that this instruction does not include loading of an overflow flag, which is uh, located in the 11th bit of this value, right? So it's not there and therefore uh, you really have to apply a mask um, if you want to directly access the result of an overflow. Uh, flag uh, inside the entire e flags register. But uh, load AH and safe AH instructions can be used to at least load this portion of the flags into the register. Another example of arithmetic instruction is um, flipping uh, the, the sign of a uh, two's complement uh, value. So it's basically convert, converting a positive to a negative or negative to a positive. So this is an arithmetic operation uh, which uh, equals multiplication by minus 1. So positive value becomes negative and negative value would become positive. 0 would remain 0. There are also, um, since we're talking about flag manipulation, there are a few instructions in this uh, handout. Um, shift left, shift right, and uh, arithmetic uh, shift right, which allow to manipulate um, individual flags combined with the carry flag. So, for instance, uh, shift left. Okay, so shift left means to shift uh, uh, in the uh, direction from right to left, uh, the values in the register, uh, such as uh, register AL, for example. The rightmost bit is uh, filled with zeros, and the leftmost bit is pushed out into the carry flag. So the carry flag also gets uh, involved here. And the register CL specifies how many shifts to make. So, for example, if we load the register CL with count 3, and then we say let's shift register AL, which has some sort of initial bit pattern like this, let's shift it three times. So, um, the uh, right uh, rightmost bit is always filled with 0 by shift left, and uh, each uh, uh, of the leftmost uh, bits is pushed out into the carry flag. So uh, we end up with this new value in the register AL. And uh, so the, 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 the uh, final result in the carry flag is also set to 1. So these are, uh, uh, these are uh, uh, instructions that allow us to uh, multiply by 2 or divide by 2 if we shift right. So these are very important instructions um, in general. And uh, so they uh, work like this involving the carry flag. Shift right uh, instruction is, is very similar to shift left. 
is just the opposite again uh, zeros the most significant uh, bit is filled with zeros and the less significant bit is is pushed out into the carry flag according to um, the counter of bits that need to be shift in register cl and so arithmetic shift instruction like this uh, is uh, basically the same as shift uh, right except that most significant bit is shifted back to itself this preserves the original sign of the destination operand so these are examples of shift instructions and that's um, in summary uh, everything uh, that uh, you should know as the basic uh, uh, set of um, instructions and uh, different kind of status flags associated with the results of these in instructions in the CPU E flags register that we already examined uh, using our masks.